Here we have verse 34 of the 15th chapter, Matthew. We're in the midst of the account which Matthew provides of the feeding of the 4,000. Follows up from, of course, the earlier feeding of the 5,000, which Matthew has already reported to us. In this case, it seems that the disciples have a little uh, amnesia. They've forgotten the miracle Jesus uh, provided at that point. And uh, so now, once again, they're in a bit of a uh, quandary as to how exactly to deal with the crowds. And Jesus puts the question to them, uh, how, many, uh, how much food do you have? What do you have in your resources? And so the response is provided uh, to him in this verse, uh, uh, reflecting fairly uh, limited resources. So uh, we have Kai, the connective lege from Lego I say, third person singular, present active indicative, he says, present tense, a twice, indirect object, dative, plural, masculine, to them, subject of the verb, oh Jesus, the Jesus. So Jesus says to them, uh, posus, this is from posos, it's an interrogative adjective, sometimes called an interrogative pronoun, depending on how it's used. Here, however, it's modifying artus, uh, bread, in the plural, so um, how many breads? It's in the accusative because it's the object of the verb here, ekete, third pers or second person plural, present active indicative. How many breads do you have? You have how many breads? Uh, and uh, <coughs> so we have the question put to them. Uh, they give the answer, hoi. Standing here is a uh, pronoun subject of the uh, response of clause de postpositive, so they, apen, answered, third person plural, aorist active indicative, hepta, adjective, means seven, so they have seven breads, in the plural, chi oliga, this is from oligos, means a few, uh, Ichthudia from ekthudion. Ichthus, of course, is the word for fish. This is a diminutive form of that same word. And so it's usually rendered little fish, uh, as if to trivialize almost the quantity of fish available. So a few little fish would be the notion. So again, the sense of the uh, response is that uh, this is an impossible situation and uh, the resources available are simply going to fall uh, very, very far short of the demand.